Oh, great. Where is the performance? Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Laura Convenience Square HQM, one of the multiple assistants and sympathetic extension of Miss Barrett. Because of this evolution of our ever-changing technical world, we are being thrust into a new realm of creative emancipation. However, this mass expansion has thrown our integrity into question and is creating a conflict of identity. Today's rapid globalization has prompted me to work in terms of metamorphosis and utopias. Because the human form and technology seem contradictory, the physical body tries to position itself in relation to it. Our own body image clashes and even substitutes itself for representations. Our fascination with new technology constantly tempts us to cross the line from the physical world into other landscapes. This is because the body and mind crave desire. We can be more than a man, woman, or animal in our ephemeral and complex lives. In reference to gender and animal studies, for example, the idea of using the batters as a simulated medium is a demonstration of my themes such as fleshless body and digital identities. Like 15th century aesthetic preoccupation, I focus my work process of incarnation and disincarnation. However, my jewels are low and high technological. Also, it is often more mistakes and defects in a perfect world. I find poetic and ludic lines for myself and ourselves to create virtual, artificial and vivid representations. It evolves throughout human nature, commonplaces and deja vu experiences in life during wartime. I'm thinking on an alter ego's meaning, some travels from visible to invisible, from ending to unending, from profane to holy, from natural to transcendental from word to silence, slash, slash, and have a beauty mess inside, slash, a mess inside, slash, a beauty mess, http, www.pascalbatter.com. Thank you. This is some extent, except of my book. I, I edited a book last year. And uh, with some picture, I will, I will read you some uh, excerpts of um, Foucault from the Utopian Body. Uh, I found the English translation on notes from the coming community. No, really, there is no need for magic, for enchantment. There is no need for a soul or a death, for me to be both transparent and opaque, visible and invisible, life and thing. For me to be a, to be a utopia, it is enough what I be a body. All those utopia by which I evaded my body when they are quite simply their model and their first application. They are the place of origin in my body itself. I really was wrong before to say that utopias are turned against the body and destined to erase it. They were born from the body itself and perhaps afterwards they turn against it. And the uh, second except is maybe it should also be said that to make love is to feel one's body close in on oneself. It is finally to exist outside of any utopia. With all of one's density between the ends of the other, under the other's finger running over you, all the invisible parts of your body begin to exist. Again the lips of the other, use become sensitive. In front of his half-closed eyes, 
you face a curious certitude. Where is the gaze, finally, to see your closed eyelids? Love also, like the mirror, unlike death, it's a basic the utopia of your body. It urges it, it curves it, it encloses it as if in a box. It shuts on sees it. This is why love is so closely related to the illusion of the mirror and the menace of death. And if despite those two perilous figures that surround it, we love so much to make love, it is because in love the body is him. Internet, also what I think about the life on internet 
on the on the human being um, is to evolve on to to uh, um, because uh, in, in portrait in, I include also animal studies on post colonialism because I live in Belgium on colonialism and post colonialism are very present and it's also uh, a taboo. It is the, the project I started, the title is I Kill Belgium, Belgium Kills Me. It's a nephron fiction, a story in perspective of will, virtual or naturalist avatars. An identical and bestial suicide released for the exhibition is an equality good to talk about. Uh, it's uh, a place in uh, Brussels called uh, Central Electric. With the hunting trophy self portrait on a video, advertises on Facebook on a petition, and this is a, a screen capture of the blog. The sinecure is a small stray dog who was thrown in the river and left to die. Today, this urban legend, legend is emblem of a cosmopolitan and high-colored Brussels city. In, in this project, I use the reference and I like America and America likes me from a verse. In 1974, and um, also the project of um, Kulik is I Built America and America Beats Me. And finally, of the famous debate around the project of uh, uh, the Mexican artist Vargas, who was, uh, um, uh, he, he pretended to let a dog die in a gallery. And this project uh, run on the internet, uh, still run on the internet with petition. And I just uh, do a rapid uh, study about the, the processes and the debate about this. And I play with the rumor on self mockery As uh, Deleuze in his alphabet primer described how some animals have territories contrary to some people who don't, especially uh, uh, in, in the parallel with uh, Facebook. The, the question is, could the internet social networks fill these lakes? Scarlett Bapai, PhD, was, was created on December uh, in 2008 on Facebook. And uh, she's uh, single, she has uh, 50, uh, 600 friends and added to uh, 130 groups on uh, 19 uh, animal rights causes. And uh, it's also an anagram of my name. And I, I use uh, uh, some weeks Facebook with this uh, profile to uh, give um, credit to Scarlet Rapal. It's on the limit between the fault and no fault, always beyond the limit between you and the animal, but just so that we are never separate with it. Every animal has a world. Is it quite curious because there are lots of people who have no world? They live the life of everyone. That is so to, to say anyone anything. Territorial animals are amazing because established a territory is almost the birth of art. And because people need needs to reappropriate territories on uh, this Facebook, they uh, uh, they create a lot of groups, pages, or, um, yeah. I use it for this. Scarlett Raphael denounced and create a Facebook group 
of uh, 2,000 members against the realization of a project in Belgium which uses the cruelty to dogs in the name of contemporary art. The artist plans to stuff a stray dog from the streets of Brussels in homage to the legend of the Sinoke. I realized the project that without dog, we met a real dog, the dog was me. I worked with a famous taxidermist in Belgium to realize this self-portrait. People were invited to see the result in the context, context of the exhibition. But all the people who signed the petition against the project um, uh, don't come to the exhibition. Because they just uh, read something on the internet and give address, sign, and uh, that's it. And finally, the, the, the trophy was a, a self-portrait. Ugly, for sure. This is the, my second project. It's more on, about uh, stereotypes, about gender, about uh, the movement on kick and queer. And here it's Sleep Wendy's, it's my avatar on the second life. I don't use it now so much because it's not very interesting to stay in second life. But uh, I, yeah, I, I think she will die or she will suicide herself soon. The next project. Is, um, the name is This Is Me. Um, it's, it's the print you have on um, the paper. Symbolic, symbolically, the intimate part of a scanned image could be its pixel. Specifically, it's a display of paintings on multi-touch screens. This tangible or digital project is making in collaboration with uh, a copyist painter, Isabelle Rapteta in France. And uh, how to share this sensitive with digital and traditional tools. What is a profile or a profile photography? Um, on the internet, I, I'm a fantasm for myself. I produce image and I can imagine I'm someone else. I'm fascinated by Renaissance portrait. I did portraits, fiction portraits and self-portraits since 10 years. And I can imagine just put a profile or a photograph uh, of myself without thinking of the history of photography, of uh, the story of portrait. And uh, as Vito said, explained, uh, techniques, uh, techniques are now uh, available for everyone. And, uh, but where is the essence of that? And, uh, um, when I started this project, I was starting for uh, something very precise. It was the, the, because after Facebook, after a, a lot of net, social network, we need always to add a, a photography or a profile portrait. And I collect, I collect uh, for some years uh, portraits on. Uh, on Google, and uh, it's always a biography of, of a special woman, as it were Georges Sand, Matari, Anna Bonham, 
Catherine de Médicis, um, uh, Virginia Woolf, and um, yeah, it's also a play with mask, religion, sexuality, celebration, and uh, a French song said, "Hide all works I want to show." This is because I, I work on now, it's, I work on uh, extreme zoom, but uh, maybe extreme zoom is never to find the pixel. You zoom zoom on a, on a picture and you never find the pixel. The, the, the soft we create uh, the, the picture, uh, a simulation of a good picture, but it's become totally abstract. And it's why I would like to use it because we are also um, um, a patchwork of abstraction. And I will present this project from museum to confront it with the real uh, portrait paintings, for sure. And uh, this is the real painting. The, the, the idea is I upload uh, paintings from Google Image. It's compressed. It's come from museum, I have no copyright for this. I change it because I play with mask. I um, uh, is, uh, uh, decompress uh, and I print it and I offer the print to the painter and after she gave me back a painting with all default because all the, the changing uh, are in the painting no, it's like a, a human uh, phone we repeat something on this. Not totally different but details are, are very different. And um, this project is also a play with the collection, the market and uh, the state of museum. I like to explain our news on the internet, I don't surf. And I, I, I use my musings to collect uh, video, picture, film, text, or uh, friends. And uh, because the muse, uh, muses come uh, from the museum, because the museum is a place for muse, I uh, will revert the to replace new muse in the museum and combine this with uh, performance and uh, we pass on in the, in the, in the museum um, for example to, to I, we can uh, have some a mask, a real mask from, uh, uh, not this one but I create a mask from a pixel of my, my stuff The, the novel part is uh, the collaborative performance online, I did, and uh, I still do. Um, I, I take three, three examples. The first one is uh, a group. Uh, it's a project, the uh, uh, name is uh, Angry Woman uh, from uh, Amiya Morans. And uh, this group is constituted of ladies I met sometimes, somewhere, yeah, in the internet, on whose work is related to computer performance, writing, or contemporary art practice. After two performances where uh, 24 women are dif of different nationalities, using their mother tongue, said their anger, in front of our webcams at home until there was none left. This uh, is an except of uh, a sound uh, artwork I did last uh, winter. And I mix a uh, performance where I sing or I play with the litany and I use also uh, some synthetic voices I mix together to play with me. Like, uh, uh, um, Chow, 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 chow. 
this is also a, a print screen on the last thing I, I will uh, show you. It's um, about what we, we talked yesterday with Yana on the copyright. I did a lot of video without copyright. I upload a lot of things, but it's more amateur videos of very famous movies. And I don't take really risk. And uh, the video I, I did uh, with the, this project with Frau Pitcher is uh, uh, I mix uh, um, um, Lady Gaga and uh, Marina Abramovic because I found uh, an interview of Lady Gaga where she uh, explained and explained um, the um, um, limitless of Marina Abramovic and she um, is so uh, impressive and, uh, um, and I found another interview of Abramovic who she speaks about the music and the sound, artwork and uh, she uh, explains it's the most uh, better uh, art uh, the most impressive art is sound and I will uh, put in a uh, in parallel and to mix the, the narcissistic image of two stars and uh, yeah, I have no, no um, right for this but yeah. <laughs> this is without sound because I, I uh, do a performance with uh, this uh, video